Cove went into the return leg with plenty to do as they trailed 2-0 and they quickly set about trying to turn the tie around. A long ball found Conor Ellis who was able to control and calmly far past goalkeeper Stephen McGuinness inside the first minute. And it got better for Cove after the draw to defence failed to deal with the cross. Shane O'Connor collected the ball and beat Colm DC and Jake Highland before slipping at home and leaving the playoff level at 2-2. But Drada bagged what proved to be a crucial goal on the hour mark. Adam Wickstead did well down their right, leaving two Cove players on the ground before delivering a pinpoint cross. Gareth McCaffrey applied the finish with a volley to beat Paul Hunt between the Cove posts. Drada then progressed despite losing the second leg 2-1. A 3-2 win on aggregate was enough to take Pete Mahan's team through to meet Wexford Youths over two games for a place in the Premier Division next year.